Um, obviously not the result any of us wanted. We knew we'd have to play extremely well to have a chance to win that game here tonight. And uh, at times, actually, we did, you know, but we're going against a really good football team and, and a really unbelievable college football atmosphere. So great opportunity for our kids today and did some good things. I think that in this world where it's so easy to hit the reset button and to just quit, I don't think you saw any of our guys quit today. I think you saw them fight until the school board says zero, 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 and that's a lot to build on. Uh, I just told them in the locker room that this game is really pure. And so as we watch the film, we're going to see where we won and where we lost and where we have, where we have to improve, quite frankly. And uh, there's some opportunities for improvement. There's a great challenge for us entering the last game that, we're, that we have as a college football team, last game some of our seniors will ever play in our great sport. And we're going to pour everything we have into this next week. Uh, with that, I'll open up for questions. Coach, talk about the uh, – uh, do in the uh, first half, especially when you needed to move to extend it, the offense. And yeah, you know, I think we were three of five in the first half. Right. And uh, still thought that there were a couple opportunities left out there in the first half. In the second half, you know, we got to get got to get those chains moving. And luckily we were able to get some drives going where we weren't converting on third down. We didn't have to. We were getting enough on first and second down. That's a big plus. You know, I think Every time we'd hit a big run or get a drive going, we had a negative run. And, you know, where a lineman would get whipped up front or, or something went wrong. And those things are hard. It's hard to be behind the sticks in Death Valley against that defense. So, Ignite. And again, as you're thinking, talking about things to build on, you know, we want to get build it to where that's an automatic. Every third and fourth down inside a yard is a go for it. And that's really what the home intellectual brutality has to be about. We have to be about that, and we have to be able to do those things. But you're right. In this stadium, it gets a great defense. Number seven team in America. I'm proud of our guys for doing that. And then going through the season, <coughs> the, the recurring theme was we need to play four quarters. Um, in your estimation, this game, do you think y'all lived up to those four quarter expectation? We played hard for four quarters. There's no doubt in my mind. Uh, there's going to be some things up film where we definitely could have played better. And uh, we need to play better to have opportunities. Because as challenging as this is for us to come in here and do that, we want this program at a place where we come in here and we're like, yeah, let's find a way. Let's take this team to deep water. Because again, like I kind of thought like if we could get a few things rolling early, we really might take this team to deep water. And at some point, we're going to get over that, that hump when we take teams to the fourth quarter. And so that's always my challenge to these guys right now. Let's keep playing. Let's keep playing. So again, effort-wise, absolutely. No quit in him. Absolute fight. We got to play better. And Juma capping things off with his first career touchdown. I think that's really cool. I think I assume everybody on our team is really happy for Juma. He's really taken anything we've asked of him, whether it's the Wildcat stuff, uh, whether it's actually being a running back, whether it's doing anything in special teams, he's taken it. And he puts so much time into it and cares about it so much. And I think these guys really cheer for him. Uh, so that, that was really cool. The other thing that was really cool was on that play, on that touchdown, there's a lot of guys hitting people in the mouth. And there's still, uh, again, really good football players lined up across from us. So pretty cool stuff. But happy for Juma. I mean, what a memory, right? Your first touchdown in your college career. Uh, is that his first touchdown? Mm -hmm. Yeah, coming at Death Valley. Uh, again, I'm still jealous of these kids. They got the opportunity to go out there and play in front of that environment today. Anything else?